There are some cars out there that have left-hand thread lug nuts on one side. What's the deal with that? This trend actually predates the automobile. Obviously, a threaded fastener is loosened or tightened by rotating it. The direction of the rotation, coupled with the orientation of the threads, decides whether it's loosening or tightening. When threaded fasteners started being used to attach wheels onto the axles of horse buggies, they would often rub up against the center of the wheel. The friction between the fastener and the wheel would sometimes be enough to get the fastener to turn, and if the wheel was turning in a direction that would loosen the fastener, eventually the wheel would work that fastener all the way off. To fix this, you'd have to assume that these buggies typically only go forward, so the wheels are typically going to turn in just one direction. So if a wheel is moving forward and the fastener happens to move with that wheel, you'd want that fastener to tighten. If you're looking at the wagon from the right side, as the wheel moves forward, it's rotating in a clockwise manner, so you want the tightening action to be clockwise, so it's a normal right-handed thread. On the other side, the wheel rotates counterclockwise, so it's a left-handed thread. Now when motor vehicles came to be, there wasn't just one day where there was horse carriages one day and then motor vehicles the next day. They kind of blended together, and people that would work on those horse buggies would also work on vehicles. Gradually, motor vehicles made the transition from a single center fastener to multiple fasteners on a hub. With the hub design, the lug nuts aren't in the center of the wheel, so the wheel doesn't have the tendency to spin those lug nuts off. However, at the time, it was pretty much industry standard to have the left side wheels fastened with reverse thread fasteners. Technicians came to expect that. Being the first to divert from that standard would mean your vehicles were the ones that would annoy the people that work on them. All these cars over here are normal, and then there's these cars over here with the weird lug nuts. Chrysler was the last company to produce a car that had lug nuts with left-hand threads. From 1975 onwards, pretty much every car ever made has right-hand threads all around. Sometimes quirks of the past just hang around for a long time. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you in the next Car Simplified video.